Hey guys, welcome back to Andy's Dinosaur Reviews. I've recently been asked to do a few more unboxing videos as people do seem to enjoy those. So I've decided to do one today because I just got a package in from one of the most underrated dinosaur stores on the internet and that would be DeJenkins.com. If you've never visited DeJenkins and you are a fan of dinosaur figures, I highly suggest that you do just that. Go check their website out today because not only do they have many of the current new releases that you see coming out all the time in the dinosaur collecting community, but they have absolutely tons of old retired figures that you really can only find on DeJenkins.com because most websites by now are long sold out, but somehow DeJenkins still somehow manages to keep stock of a lot of these older figures or at least for a limited time until they do sell out which is just my favorite part of DeJenkins.com all the very cool older retired figures that you can still find for a good price that is awesome if you ask me so I just got this box in let's break this open and take a look at what we got so the very first thing that actually is in here is a little slip about Recur and Recur is probably one of the most underrated dinosaur companies in the world right now I would imagine because they honestly make so many different species and they're actually really quite cool figures unfortunately I personally don't have very many of them in fact I think I only have two I would love to change that at some point in the very near future get more of them on the channel for you guys but on top of making many dinosaur figures you can see ocean life wildlife and farm life here so they do have quite the array of other figures and this little slip is really cool that's included here in the DeJenkins box and if you actually look at the other side you can now get an idea of a lot of the dinosaur figures and just a ton of the different species that they have created and this isn't even all of them actually because it looks like this slip might have been from last year because I actually don't see any of the new 2019 releases on this slip and I know they had a Carnotaurus and everything which I was really quite interested in getting a hold of so on top of all of these figures they actually have quite a few more so that is a really cool little addition that was thrown in the box by DeJenkins kind of promoting a little recur in your life and there is nothing wrong with that. So the very first one that I have here is this one which you probably have a hard time seeing and believe it or not I actually did not have this figure previously. This is the Collecte Bistahiverser which again I'm not positive if that's how you say the name of the species as I'm very unfamiliar with it but it's an extremely cool looking Tyrannosaur and it's a figure that I've really wanted for a very long time and I now have in my collection to review for you guys then the next one would be this one and this is the Safari LTD giant sloth another incredibly awesome figure that I did not have previously and the final one is one that I'm actually really quite excited about and that is this this is an older Bullyland Triceratops and I definitely really like the overall appearance of this so let's go ahead break each one out of the packaging really quickly and we'll take a quick glance at them before we end the video so just like the order that we brought them in before here is the Bista Hiverser which is really really cool looking beautiful as far as the paint application goes I really quite like it the sculpt and everything looks fantastic the really nicely feathered look on this looks incredible and then we have the Safari LTD Giant Sloth. This is a figure that I've really wanted for quite a long time. I actually don't think I have any figures of the Giant Sloth. So I was psyched to get the Safari LTD version here. Really nicely glossed mouth and eyes. I could say that straight away. Along with the paint apps on this one are fantastic. And then we've got the Bullyland Triceratops and I've really started to appreciate Bullyland a lot more recently. Their figures have really grown on me and I've found myself searching for them a lot more often than I used to and this Triceratops is really really nice looking and I definitely wanted to get a hold of it and now thanks to DeJenkins I have it here in my collection. So each and every one of these figures will be coming up for review. Each one really looks beautiful honestly. Let me know in the comments guys which one you think we should review first out of these three and as soon as this video is over make sure you head over to DeJenkins.com and check that website out. I'll include a link in the description 
for you to head on over there and check out what figures they have in stock because as I said on top of having many of the new releases that each company releases as time goes on they have so many old figures like the Bista Haverser and the Giant Sloth and also retired ones like the Triceratops stuff that you just can't find very often anymore but you can still get it at a retail price on to Jenkins so if there are any figures that you've been trying to get a hold of but haven't really been able to acquire make sure you go check out the Jenkins.com today and you may just find that figure right there on the website for you to buy again at retail which is way better than what you're gonna find anywhere else like eBay or Amazon right now because for retired figures you kinda pay out the behind when it comes to those websites but Checking out DeJenkins.com could quite possibly land a gold mine in your lap when it comes to finding older retired figures that you may not be able to find for a good price, again at an incredibly good price. And also, like I said, newer figures that have been just recently released and even figures that are going to be released very soon. They always stock pretty much everything when it comes to dinosaur figures. So again, check the description. There will be a link there for DeJenkins.com. And also let me know in the comments which one of these figures you want to see reviewed first. But before you do all that, don't forget to please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.